Hey guys, welcome back. This is Bernardo from BTN HD, and yes, uh, we got a new product this week, and we're checking out the Lenovo IdeaPad 120S, uh, under $500, which is not that bad. So uh, let's do the first impressions and unboxing. All right, so what comes inside the box? Uh, super, super easy. Uh, not too many things come inside the box, just three things. You have your power adapter, which uh, if I can read correctly, it is 20 volts. You have your uh, safety warranty and setup guide. And you have the beautiful IdeaPad 120S, which is under $500. Uh, a couple of things that I know so far about this laptop, first impressions, is that it looks awesome, super light. Uh, I'm assuming around 2 pounds, 2.5 pounds maybe. This is the 11.6 inch uh, version. There's two of them, 11 and 14. Uh, depends on what you want. I, I really like the 11 inch display one, which is nice. Uh, the processor clock speed is 1.10 gigahertz. It comes with an Intel Celeron N3350 processor. Uh, the graphics card is an Intel HD Graphics 500. It only comes with two gigs of onboard memory. That basically means you can't upgrade it. You're stuck with two gigs. Uh, primary operating system is Windows 10 Home. Again, the display for this version that we're testing out this week is 11.6 HD with a resolution of 1366 by 768. Now, if you're getting the 14-inch display, you're still going to get the same resolution. For hard drive space, you're only going to get the 64 gigs, uh, and it's embedded. So I, I, I'm assuming you can't really upgrade it, uh, but I'm definitely going to open this guy up and see if there's any upgradable parts. But, but I definitely know that the memory is on board. It's embedded within the motherboard. The hard drive is a little hip iffy, but I have to test that out with the IdeaPad 120S. Now the IdeaPad 120S has a lot of ports to get you up and running for your workday. Uh, on your right hand side, if you have it to the point that you're able to open up like this, uh, we have a 3.0 USB port. We have a combo audio jack, which allows you to hook up your headphone slash mic. You have a micro SD card reader. And right here next to that card reader, you have your one key recovery. Now on the other side, we have a power port. Uh, right next to the power port, that's the light indicator. Uh, an additional 3.0 USB port, an HDMI, and also a Type-C USB port. All right, so I'm pretty excited to have the IdeaPad 120S in the lab. Uh, I'm super surprised that it's light. Uh, first impressions of it, I love the color. I think the color is around, uh, Lenovo states it's like mineral gray. It's like a grayish color. Uh, really nice. I love it. I don't know too much information about the webcam. I'm assuming the webcam is about 720p. The keyboard layout is really nice. I like it. Touchpad automatically. It's nice and small. It's not wide, but it does have that nice little indication right here for the left and right. That's a good thing. Uh, the shift key is not small. I was kind of expecting the shift key to be small, but it's not. It's nice and large. All right, cool. I'll turn this guy on and see how fast it goes. Uh, because again, 64 gigs don't really consider this laptop to be a gaming laptop. There's no way that you can install gaming, uh, a game into this machine and play with no problem. 64 gigs, you got to understand uh, Windows updates, uh, installing the game, and then you have the operating system. It's 64 gigs is going to run up real fast. And if you're looking for a small laptop, real cheap laptop to do maybe designing or illustration, I don't recommend this at all, this laptop. To me, I see it as uh, it's classified as a day-to-day uh, -day checking email, shopping, Word documentation, Excel. But overall, uh, hopefully next week we will do the review on the IdeaPad S. If you have any questions on it or you want me to touch base on anything like battery, definitely I'm doing the battery. Uh, definitely I'm doing the heating and all that other stuff. But if you have any other recommendations, leave it at the bottom of the video. Hit that like button and I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace out.